Installing Hitman 3 mods is actually easy, and I'm saying this even though I have no actual modding experience. Because all you need is a single mod that will do all the work for you, and that is the simple mod framework. In here you have a nice and clean overview of all your modding activity. You can select mods you want to use, maybe adjust some settings, and with the press of a button they will be installed without you having to do anything. And installing this mod is really easy. First you need to find your Hitman 3 folder. Both Epic and Steam have an easy way to show you the file location and the installation path. In here you're gonna create a new folder called Simple Mod Framework. Make sure it's written like I do. Then head over to the mod download I linked down below. And once the download is finished, all you need to do is extract the zip file into the Simple Mod Framework folder we just created. I would recommend making a shortcut, so you don't have to look up the framework folder every time you want to use it. You can ignore all these things for now, the mod manager is basically the only thing you will need. The first time you may get a warning like this, but you can safely ignore that. What's missing now are the mods themselves. The simple mod framework automatically comes with a skip intro and better AI mod. But of course, Nexus Mods has many more. Not all mods are compatible with the framework however. So if you find an interesting one, just quickly check if there is a framework download. Once you're done with your selection, come back to the mod manager. This option right here will let you import all your downloads. And that's it, now you can freely enable and disable mods with a few button presses. If the framework or a mod gets an update, you'll be able to update everything in here. And if you want to get rid of a mod completely, just go to this folder here and delete the file. So if you're on PC but hesitated to get into modding, I can only recommend to give this a try. It's honestly such an easy way to massively improve the game experience or to just have some fun. And I'm planning on doing more mod showcases in the future, so definitely stay tuned for those.